Josh, and today I'm going to be talking about sleep and some strategies for you to improve the quality of your sleep. It's estimated that one in three Americans has trouble sleeping or some trouble with insomnia and it even gets worse as we get older. People over 60, it's estimated that one in two or 50% of people have some trouble sleeping. The important thing to realize about sleep is we all look for that quick fix with some over-the-counter medication. But a lot of the times there's some high leverage lifestyle changes, what we call sleep hygiene, that we can make to improve the quality of your sleep. So we'll be posting things on our Facebook page throughout the week for these lifestyle changes so you can see if we can improve the quality of your sleep. If you have any questions on them, feel free to stop in, talk to any of your local hometown pharmacist. If those things aren't adequate after working with your pharmacist and doctor, then we can look at adding um, an over-the-counter sleep aid. The place I always like to start, particularly as we get older, is with melatonin. Melatonin is a naturally occurring substance in our brain that regulates our sleep-wake cycle, or our circadian rhythm. So if you're having trouble falling asleep, met melatonin can be very helpful, and it doesn't cause the hangover sedation, like the antihistamine-containing products, the ZQL and the Unisom, that can have particularly detrimental effects down the road with fall risk as we get older. If you have any questions on your sleep hygiene or some methods to help you fall asleep faster and improve the quality of your sleep, feel free to stop in and talk to your local hometown pharmacist.